Hello everybody, I'm Zeris, your favorite Dragon Gamer, and welcome to the stream, or video if you happen to be watching this over on YouTube. Today we're going to be continuing The Last of Us Remastered. Uh, very unfortunately, last episode at the very end, I paused at a very scary part. So, we're gonna have to go through the creepy, dark, dungeon-y area of the hotel. Okay, so here's some loot. So, the scariest part about this... Can I even craft? in this water. I cannot. Oh boy. Uh, so... I'm terrified of this, like, section of the game. Because... If I remember correctly, there's going to be two bloaters, and I definitely do not have enough ammo or anything to be taking on even one bloater. Crafting speed. I don't need crafting speed right now. God really not a fan of this entire section of the game. Loot. We're gonna make sure this is loaded real quick. Can't craft. I hate this so much. Definitely gonna need this more than I need the Healy. Can't go this way. Huh, and it would have been so simple too. Like, okay, Joel, you can maybe move that one. Right? The water water is like lubrication, I guess. You could kinda move this beam till it slides yeah, yeah there, there, there's a very easy way for a grown man to get out of that situation
I really don't know what I'm doing. Can't go that way. That's just a storage area. Oh, I go further down. <sighs> really not excited. Mm-hmm. This is just, uh... Terrifying. Absolutely terrifying part of the game. dragon plays this is <laughs> this is not a bathroom I don't well I mean it could be it's like a basement area that is too large for its own good all right I can cr really Oh no. No. I'm nowhere near the ready for this. The moment I turn on one of those generators, a bunch of shit's about to go crazy. Yes, but I haven't played this game in ab in years. Okay, there's the key card. That was terrifying. What the fuck? Let me hit him. I hate that I'm almost dead. <laughs> I hate this so much. to use my only med kit that that soon oh 
Oh, thank God, more shotgun ammo. I'm going to stay crouched. Because I'm terrified of this area. Can I use a shiv? Nope. <laughs> Is it at all possible for me to skip these bloaters entirely and just You're about to get a blue screen because I'm about to save. I am literally having a heart attack right now. Like, the like I stopped the last episode abrupt, like early, like like really early because I didn't have it in me to do this part of this game. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I really do be needing a diaper right now. Damn it. Can I make it? Let me in. Oh my god, it just let me skip that entire fucking fight. Oh. 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 I could have done that years ago? You're telling me that section of the game with two bloaters and at least three clickers I could have skipped that entire thing this whole time this is the part of the game that is the reason I have not replayed it in 10 years and you're telling me I could have just skipped it okay I guess if you get the uh, the um card early on this is not a problem barely an inconvenience except I'm having a heart attack I should yeah just uh... I just realized it's Bell. Hi, Bell. Your emotes pointed out who you who you are. Oh. Upgrade bench. That's unsettling. Can I get armor piercing? No. I feel like it's going to be a while before I can get armor piercing, so I'm just going to get this extra pistol slot. Let's see. 
There's nothing I can get without a just fine. pliers. Ooh, nice. Alright, so I'm gonna assume that door is to continue, this door is a ship door. Or not. It is, however, a loot door. It's not enough loot to craft. I have 40 pills. Hmm. I, I don't know what to do. Um. Maybe I'll save for Shiv Master. Because being able to kill clickers with a shiv right away by grabbing them, or uh, being able to save myself when a clicker grabs me is just a great ability in general. Oh, okay. This kitchen has either people. Okay, it has an infected. Finish it. Oh. I got it. Nicely done. You did. Not today. You? Not today. All right. Let's prep. Shit. <laughs> the other dudes just did not get alerted to that guy's death. They know it's me now. Human, it's what's for dinner. In this game, yeah. And pretty sure these guys are cannibals. Whoo! How do you not see me, my dude? Bye! Oh, that was just a helmet. There goes your head. Was there anything looty in that kitchen? Like, I completely skipped it because there's other people to dispatch. Ooh, a baseball bat. Definitely gonna need that. Oh, this is where we're... Okay, let me just... Didn't... Okay. I thought that menu-looking thing was glowy for a bit. Alright. Oh, well, let's go. Sure there's yep 
QTEs. Just hang back like I told you to. Bane of my oh QTEs, yeah. Uh -oh. I'm glad I didn't, right? I'm glad I didn't get my head blown off by a goddamn kid. Look, you know she had actually know. really good accuracy with that shot. Me, Ellie. I, I know it wasn't easy, but it was either him or me. Thanks for saving my ass. You got anything like that for me, Joel? We gotta get going. Damn, bro. You know, all things considered, she had better aim than I have in a majority of situations so far. Take Dexter and Neville to your mom's... Oh. It's not safe here, don't worry. We take good care of her. Oh, okay. That's not creepy at all. Wait there, okay. There yeah, she she's rightfully upset. Like Joel should just be glad that the dude didn't kill him. Ellie was like, you know, holding her own. She 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 survived. She saved us. No, my baseball bat has enough health. In fact, let's let's give it a little extra. Oomph. Actually, full up on shivs, which is nice. What's not nice is my lack of ammo for the sniper rifle. We need to get back out. Find that bridge. Yeah. She's like <laughs> very understandably upset, Joel. Like, like, dude couldn't be even the least bit grateful that he's not a you know a corpse right now. Missing a rag. Is that really all the shot the ammo I can carry for a shotgun? Alright, so there's no getting out this way. Nice! That's great considering I just made a melee weapon with the spiky boy.
that's a rag. It's a uh, backdrop. People would take their pictures in front of it. Yeah, I know what it is. Okay, then. Something on your mind, Ellie? <sighs> I wasn't trying to disobey you back there. You were taking a really long time, and I thought maybe he's gotten into trouble. <sighs> it don't matter what you thought. I need you to listen to me. I do. It's just that... I don't know, man. Being a kid in a world that has, like, gone to shit, like, in perspective, she was born after the, the like, outbreak. So, she has literally never known any pleasure that, that we have known. That door looks like a way. Hey, you see a way to get up there? Nope. It's very simple. I'll be able to get through with this. Move piano. Hand is as long as I thought. Yeah, how about a hand? You sure you can trust me with that? Ellie. <sighs> Push! I am! Push harder! There, how's that? Let's go. But like, she she has lived in this world that is like com like complete shit, and then she comes to these places, sees all these things that like we took for granted, right? Like this is this this is like a prom venue. Like, if you look right there, it says prom 2013. God, I feel old. God, I feel old. That was so long ago, man. Um, but, like, prom 2013, and <laughs> she hasn't known any of the pleasures of this, of this life, uh, of the way things used to be. She, she, she did not... I feel so old. 2013 is like a lifetime ago for me. That 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 is like <laughs> that is nine years ago. It's crazy. Um, that's like nearly half my lifetime. Like she she she's like coping with uh, like her best. She she is doing her best to cope with the fact that she has a bite on her arm that any other person in the entire world would would by now be a like mindless freak trying to eat people's heads and also she she's watched people die around her she's like been attempted to be killed and it's just like She's a kid, and she's having to deal with all this. Ah, uh, there's about to be a cutscene, that's why I'm stopping here. Um, and, and she just saved this grown-ass man's life by doing something that she really didn't want to do. Like, taking a life is not easy. Like, she didn't want the gun so that she could go off and kill people. She wanted the gun so that she could, like, be useful and take, like, protect... Joel, or at least protect herself so Joel doesn't have to worry. And Joel's just being an asshole about it because, like, he lost his daughter. And, like, losing everything he's lost in the 20 years since the outbreak has, like, really broken him down. Like, the character development in this game is amazing. The writing in this game is amazing. I love it. Mm. Alright. As soon as we hop in this box, it's gonna be a cutscene. <coughs> oh shit! Keep your head down. I 
right now. I'm gonna jump down there and I wanna clear us a path. What about me? You stay here. This is so stupid. We'd have more of a fucking chance if you let me help. I am. And you seem to know your way around a gun. You reckon you can handle that? Well, I sort of shot a rifle before. But it was at rats. Rats? With BBs. BBs. Well, it's the same basic concept. Lift it up. All right, now. You're going to lean right into that stock as it is going to kick a hell of a lot more than any baby rifle. Okay. Go ahead and pull the bolt back. Grab it right there. Just tug it. Here you go. And as soon as you fire, you're going to want to get another round in there quick. Listen to me. If I get in trouble down there, you make every shot count. Yeah. I got this. This was also a troubling part back when I was like a teenager playing through this game for the first time. Just so we're clear about back there, it was either him or me. You're welcome. Okay, now real talk that we just saw in a cutscene, how, how, like Joel's face in like the best lighting possible I love this remaster I, I love how much everything in this game looks better with the remaster like Ellie Ellie looks so, so much better so much realistic she actually looks more like her voice actor which is which I think is cool um Most thing in, things in this game look a lot better than they used to. The the infected are way scarier than they used to be. The bloaters are just are just so disgusting to look at now. Um, my only gripe about the remaster is Joel's face doesn't look as good as it used to, and it's real. It, it's weird. It's it gives me deep fake like aged down actor vibes you know like if you watch gemini man it's a will smith it's a movie with will smith where he plays a great military officer like the most skilled military officer that the u.s has ever like come out with and he also plays his genetic clone that is like only like 20 years old 18 years old and he's like supposed to be like in his 50s 60s and so for his clone they used like cgi to age him down to about the same age he was for like i robot or no even younger than that like the age he was like fresh prince almost and it just has that uncanny valley feeling to it and I never had that in the original in the original last of us like Joel looked fine but with the remaster Joel definitely looks like he's hit uncanny valley territory where he looks younger than he's supposed to be like he was at least in his mid to late 30s when he when he was just a normal guy before the outbreak and this is 20 years later so he's got to be hitting 50 ish and he just doesn't look it he looks like he's still in his like late 30s Kill all of them. Shit. You talk to the boss? Yeah. He wants everyone to hold their ground. Watch ah, that was dumb. That was dumb. That was fucking dumb. Okay, I'm just gonna let the flame. I I'm just gonna let them kill me. Because I need a hard reset on this. Come on, kill me. Kill me. Thank you. I definitely needed a hard reset on that. That was. Just really bad. It's true. 
You, check down there. Oh. Oh. It even took away the materials, so I was so dumb. All right, listen. Yep. Damn, damn, damn. You, go check over that way. Silence, silence, silence. <laughs> Oh, thank God, Ellie. Yeah, there goes all the ammo. No. Fuck ya. Uh, fuck, fuck, fuck. I apologize for my language or lack thereof. Ah, shit.
Oh, thank God. Okay, oh. You're really bad at this, sir. Fuck. Ellie needs to step up her aim. Nasty. Did you see like the top part of his head come off? All right, come on down. You see like his face and how it just stopped being a face? Do. Also, question: How did I get her? Give her my rifle, but still have a rifle? Was that rifle just there? It's for emergencies only. Well, I guess that was kind of like a sniper perch anyway, so maybe already. You know, the zone, uh, do you know how to switch it off? I do. You just you gotta respect it. This is not good. Okay. Okay. He picked it up in the cutscene. Yeah. <laughs> that was like one of the hardest parts of this game back when I was uh like teenager playing this when it first came out um let's pick that up um mostly just I didn't have very much co hand eye coordination and stuff like an aim don't even don't even think about aim like, back in the day, this was before I started playing Fortnite and all these other shooters. So, like, I, aim is just... Mm -mm. It's not even remotely a topic. Fireflies. We don't need the fireflies. Sure, they might have started the fight, but we're the ones that have done, that have done all the work. 
It's our blood in the streets. I don't agree with them wanting to t take the light to, to other... S I don't agree with them taking the fight to other cities. They need to earn their independence on their own, and I definitely won't take orders from some Firefly leader all the way on the other side of the country. Before the fighting ends, I suggest we rid ourselves of them. This is our city, our people. I don't see why we can't rule ourselves. Yeah, where it's just a bunch of enemies in, like, this big area. It... There's an upstairs section of that last building that I just completely missed. I'm hoping the loot here provides enough Because I did use just about all my resources in that fight. The fact that I made it through that without a single med pack, though. Mm. Ooh. Yes, please. Okay, no meds, but several di Yeah, yeah, but that's like... Me versus an army, like, in real life, that would just not happen. Like, like you would not survive a fight against, like, an entire army of peoples. Like, Rambo is just a fairy tale, you know? Alright, so that is clearly where we gotta go to progress. So, I'm just not gonna go that way yet. There's this entire building that I have yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. a 15 foot drop just would not... Mm -mm. You, you'd be out of commission. Especially if you land on your feet the way this, this dude is. Is there... Th there's no upstairs area here? Hmm. This building just really sucks, doesn't it? It's the largest building here, but, like, you can't access any of the other floors. Okay, I didn't need that hint. I just I'm I'm trying to scavenge everything I can because I just use all my resources.
Help me open this. Here. Got it. Just gonna set it up against the wall. Pretty sure that's where it's supposed to be. Yeah, I figured all the gears were pointing towards a workbench. Is this the one with the hole in the floor? No. Ah, oh, shit. That was just me being stupid. I didn't realize that the cutscene would be right there. Busy couple of days, huh? Food, old pair of shoes, feel nothing. Let's go. Okay, it, di it didn't cut me off from this. Here we go. Such a waste to leave all that meat. I'm gonna put reload speed on the hunting rifle. Also, no, scope. Definitely a scope. Awesome. You got the scope hooked up. Nice. Got it. And I... Did I upgrade the clip capacity? No. Okay. Seems like that's the only gun I have with ammo, so... Let's just keep that equipped. any ammo. That's good. Alright, so that's clear progression right there. Oh boy. Okay, bad feeling about this. Let's see, nope. Gross. Um. Oh, werewolf in the BU. You really looking at the post, Riley? Alright, I guarantee around the corner is about to be a fight. Got work from the east side crew. 
So if those are the only two people here. Joel, there's a guy up on that second floor, right there. Yeah, I see him. He's still low. me over shotgun ammo Thank God. I just watched mob ca douse Captain Ma Mastros and the rest of the team in gasoline and burn them alive. The animals, animals were actually celebrating. Some old fucker complained about it as a waste, it was a waste of gasoline. There are too many of them. All I could do was slip away, but I'll remember all their faces. Gonna hunt each one of them down if I have to. This place is pretty badly trapped, too. There's gotta be loot here. My dog is thumping, thumping, thumping. Ooh. Nice. 
need some shotgun ammo. Pretty sure she's gonna have something to say about this. Jeez. Guess this is how it ended for this zone. Yeah, every battle's got a losing side. What if they have families? Everyone has a family. Best not to dwell on it. How can you not? I mean. Fair assessment. Truck note. We finished scouring the city for any survivors. There were a handful of soldiers hiding in the hotel. We took care of them. A bunch of us raided their stockade or what was left of it. Most of it, the big machines got fucked up in the fighting. We won't be riding on a tank anytime soon. Likewise, none of the heavy artillery is salvageable. The one exception is the Humvee. We've managed to repair it including the 50 cal mounted gun. This thing is impenetrable. I'd like to see someone fuck with us now. I don't know, I'm pretty sure I just, I, I've killed a good amount of your men so far. Uh, I don't like that you can only carry 14 rounds of that. That is 100% can pages. Loot. This is better to have. Shiv door. Got it. There we go. That means loot. Finally, some handgun ammo. This last building right here doesn't look like it has any openings, though. Where's Ellie? Hey, get me up there. Right, let's get her up here. Okay. This is also right where Ellie starts being an actual like team member instead of like someone that we gotta protect. Which is nice because the game also gets harder from here. We're almost there. Yeah. Almost. at a place like this, back in the Boston QZ. A prep school? Military preparatory school. <laughs> yeah, nice way of saying orphanage. I wonder what happened to all these kids. Well, this place has been out for a good stretch. They ain't kids no more. Meaning they're either hunters trying to kill us, or they're dead. Or they got away. You don't believe that. I believe in getting out of this city. Come on. I like to get all the dialogue between them I can. It doesn't really add up to anything as far as gameplay does. But 
Posters are everywhere. I saw this right before the outbreak. You did? Was he totally gutted by the end? <laughs> Nobody gets gutted. It's a, it's a dumb teen movie. Who dragged you to see it then? I don't know. Let's just stay focused, all right? All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's not talk about his daughter who died the night of the outbreak. to be sure. However, this is about to lead. The alley. Yep. Wow, a fucking truck. That's all right, just keep your head down. Thank you. the door we can go in. Okay. Good job, Spider Monkey.
wasn't fast enough on the aim. Okay, usually respawns give you, like, a bit of cooldown. Headshot yet. What the hell? They, there's no way! There's no way the turret has that kind of an angle! Through a f How am I supposed to do this? <clears throat> this pisses me off because... I'm full. I don't see where we're supposed to go from here is the problem. Did they somehow break through the fence?
Come, come on. Come on. Thank you. Because that is clearly dire the direction I want to go. Did not apparently fix the jank, no. Meds very much more important than oh shit. oh shit. We're okay. They can't see us. And I feel like I'm about to be grabbed through this window. <laughs> yep. It's all right. They're not the bad guys. Lower the gun. Man, you hit hard. <laughs> that guy sounds and looks and looks familiar. Yeah, I thought you were one of them too. Then I saw you. You haven't noticed they don't keep kids around. Survival of the fittest. You're bleeding. Ah, it's just nothing. I'm Henry. This is Sam. I think I caught your name was Joel. Ellie. How many are with you? They're all dead. Hey, we don't know that. But we're a bunch of us. Someone had the brilliant idea of entering the city. Look for supplies. Those fuckers, they ambushed us. <clears throat> Scattered us. Now it's all about getting out of this shithole. We can help each other. Ellie. Safety in numbers and all that. She's right. Could help each other. We got a hideout not too far from here. Be safer if we chat there. All right, take us there. Follow me. Sorry about the whole gun thing. Don't worry. I would have probably done the same thing. Where are you from? All the way from Hartford. Really? I heard some bad stuff going on down there. Hold on, guys. Oh, look at that. Molotov upgrade. Nice. Oh, I know what I'm making next. How much do I need to make one? I need one unit of alcohol. We gotta be careful. We're right next to one of the lookout areas. It's just you and your daughter. We're not related. We're more like um... I promised someone I'd look after. Yeah. I can appreciate that. Yeah, so <laughs> that could have been taken the wrong way. Definitely could have been taken the wrong way. Well, you guys are just so quick to just leave without looting. Jeez. Look at all this good shit you could have just left behind. Oh, I got that unit of alcohol, I believe. No. Whatever that was was not alcohol.
Is that capybara? No, it's a buffalo. Okay. Ellie, found another one of them comics. Aren't you glad I used the shift to open that door? Okay. Oh, they had a pet. I don't. Okay, no, de no dead kitty. Assuming it's a cat because of the cat tower right there. Am I missing anything at all? Nope. That sounded like a door swinging open. ground floor. They had a glowy bit for a second. Okay. Wait, wait. Everyone be quiet. Get away from the windows. So the first thing to do is crouch in front of windows. Gone. Man, that fucking truck. It's been hounding us ever since we got in this damn. Sam, what are you doing? Nothing. Get rid of it. My backpack is practically empty. What's the rule about taking stuff? It weighs like nothing. The rule? What is it? We only take what we have to. That's right. Now come on. How far is this place? I doubt there's any useful loot in a toy store. What the fuck? You getting out of the way the moment the door opens? You you expecting something? What'd you find, Ellie? Nothing. You watch our back. Like someone was up there. Say, stick. Okay. So where are the others? They wanted to give it another one, so make sure we didn't miss anything. All right. Seventy-five. Look at that. Shift master. That's Travis Willingham's scream. I know that scream anywhere. That that was 100% a grog scream. And I would know because I before this stream I was watching uh, Critical Role. Ah oh, man, that is 100% tra Travis Willingham. Love that voice. Love that man. He is he is precious bean, and I I feel like I would die for that man. Oh, isn't this embarrassing? And it, you're dead. And you're dead. Classic misunderstanding. Um, okay, there we go. Let me get that arrow back. Did you guys drop anything? You dropped something neat. Through this door. You sure he's safe, being so close to them? I'm the only one with the key, man. And where'd you get that? I killed him. Can you make it now? Back here. Yeah, I know where you guys are going. Boom. 
Ah, oh, man. To live in a cubicle. Honestly, if I was more brain smart, I would... I, I have, like, social anxiety, so, like, working in, like, a restaurant or, like, fast food place is definitely not a good place for me to be. But I feel like if I was brain smart enough to work, like, an office cubicle job, I, I don't know, I think I would thrive in a situation like that. We had a public trial after a bunch of teenagers from our group killed the family that wandered into our city. I was sure they'd be punished for breaking our code. Instead, the boss deemed that they procured supplies for the group. I couldn't believe my ears, and it didn't end there either. He then ordered that all of us take turns hunting other survivors in the area and bringing their supplies back to camp. There was a long silence. We started walking away then. Two members of the group started yelling, protesting the new law, saying we ha he had no right to force this on us that this isn't what we fought for. I didn't dare lift a finger as the only people to display any sort of morality were killed in front of all of us. Next week is my turn to go hunting. So this was obviously a forced, like, change to their, like, social structure and the rules that they all had to follow. Um... Here we are. Welcome to my office. How long have you guys been holed up in here? A few days. We found a bit of food, though. Here. Blueberries. Found a whole stash of them. You want some? No. Hey man, relax. We're safe. So why haven't you left? Been waiting for the right opportunity. And? Here. Check this out. Look at these sons of bitches. Every day they congregate down there, guarding that damn bridge. Come nighttime, it's down to a skeleton crew. After sunset, that's our window. Most of them gone, sneak right past them. That could work. Oh, it'll work. It'll definitely work. <laughs> wow. All right, ready? Oh. Ow! <laughs> a blueberry hurt you? It's been a while since that boy even cracked a smile. She doesn't seem bothered by all this. So where were you heading? Heard the fireflies are based in the west somewhere. We're gonna join up with them. Something funny? Oh, it just seems like there's a lot of people putting their stock on the fireflies these days. Yeah, maybe there's a reason for that. So you don't know where they are, and you're just gonna drag him across the country to find them? I tell you what. How about I worry about my brother, you worry about your girl. Easy. We're looking for the fireflies, too. <sighs> this is us. There's an abandoned military radio station just outside the city. Any survivors from our group, they're supposed to meet us there tomorrow. You and your girl, you won't join us. It goes down tonight. I guess we best rest up then. Okay, in that scene, Joel looks fine. But, like, when the... When heavy, like, sunset-y lighting hits him, he doesn't look quite right. He says it's time to go. Moving fast, okay? So no matter what, you stick to me like glue. Like glue. Like glue. Got it. Good. Good. All right. Y'all ready? Yeah. Okay. All right, y'all stay close, okay? All right, so I'm going to pause here. I feel like 
an hour and a half, that's a good stopping point. And besides, while it is the s a very smooth transition into the next chapter of gameplay, there is still quite a bit left uh, for like this section and I feel like I'm gonna sp split it up into two different parts or I guess three different parts considering the last episode uh, the next episode is going to have like this big like raid like ish thing uh, a lot of people with guns a lot of like heavy artillery coming our way and yeah I think I need to rest up for that and then there's going to be a lengthy sewer trip I believe so uh, that section can all be in tomorrow's episode or I don't know how spur how much space is going to be between uploads on YouTube because so, I'm I'm recording this whole series first. But anyway, uh, for those of you who came by for the stream, I very much appreciate it. I made the stream way better. Uh, five viewers, not much, but hey, that's the most viewers I've had in a while at, during a stream. Uh, had a pretty good time. Uh, I surprisingly got through a very scary part of the game with, like, little to no issue because of, you know, just sheer dumb luck, I'm betting. Uh, I'm actually gonna look for someone to raid really quick. Um... I don't think I have any buddy to raid. Um Oh, yes I do. I am going to raid Kionko. She's playing Saints Row right now. Oh, gotta mute that because that's an advertisement. Um, so, <clears throat> if you like this video, if you're watching this as a video and you like this video, leave a like down below. And. If you like my content so far, please go ahead and subscribe. And, you know, my, my upload schedule isn't that great. So I would appreciate it if you would go and press that bell icon, you know. Also, if you want to support me financially, rather than just as a creator, uh, you can find my links to my PayPal, my Cash App, my Throne in all the various places on my Twitch channel, my YouTube channel, and on my Twitter. Uh, other than that, I hope everyone has a great day. And, uh, peace.